maybe the muffins would taste better than they looked. Oh, dear. Oh, I'm a terrible cook. I must not have a creative bone in my body. George was confused. They had the right tools. Why didn't the muffins turn out? I have nothing for the bake sale. Oh, I'll have to buy some cookies at Pischetti's. Perhaps Chef Pischetti would know what went wrong with the muffins. <laughs> I will make you a favorite dish of my grandmother. Timballo del Gattabardo, Sicilian pie. Let me just check the recipe and I will begin. Recipe? What? Okay. The chef used a recipe? Oh, uh, would you two like to help me prepare? <laughs> uh, maybe we should just go get some hamburgers. Hey, that's not a bad idea. Prepare? Well, isn't cooking just throwing things together? Getting creative? Ah. <laughs> Perhaps once you've memorized your recipe, but until then you must follow it precisely. You know, like uh, a formula. Formula? <laughs> well, it tells you exactly what to put in the dish, how to measure it, uh, how long to cook it, everything. Well, that sounds like science. <laughs> no, no, no. I like this. Oh, I see. That's what that thing was for. <laughs> oh, I think this is my best timbalo ever. Thanks to my new assistants. Hmm, torta di carotti. Oh, that sounds good. Whatever it is. Mwah, carrot cake. George and the professor had the same thought at the same time. Bake sale! <laughs> the kitchen is yours. Uh, maybe we should just go pick up donuts? Yeah, donuts. Yeah, that sounds good. That sure looks good. Uh, professor Wiseman made it. Oh, uh-huh. Wow, look at that cake. <laughs> we made two. One for the bake sale and one for Rescue Squad 86. Mm. Mm -hmm. oh. I want to try some of these formulas. I, I mean recipes. <laughs> they seem so easy now, like gene splitting. Now that George knew all about cooking, he didn't need to ask the chef about the failed muffins. 